YouTube channel. Thank you for tuning in to my very first YouTube video. It's your girl T Smith and before I get into the video I just want to say be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, today's video is basically going to be a get to know me video, uh, get to know who I am, why I want to do YouTube, and etc etc. So I have my brother behind the camera and he will be asking me questions but before he start asking me questions I just want to say I am so excited to be finally starting my YouTube video. This means a lot to me. Let's get into the question. So the first question is, what is your biggest fear? <sighs> my biggest fear is the world, the world going underwater basically because I, I'm be gone. But anyways, next question. What is your favorite snack? My favorite snack is, I don't know, mm, wings. Wings is my favorite food, so you don't got to ask me that. Wings is my favorite food. Next question. What is your favorite candle scent? All of them. All of them. Candles is, in general is just my favorite, so. Are you more likely to avoid conflict or engage it head on? Anyways, it's whatever with me. You know what's up. If it's up there, it's stuck there for sure. But um, nobody won't beef with me. I don't want beef with nobody else. So with that being said, I ain't gonna engage in no beef unless you touch me. Period. Period. Next question. Are you a good cook? Mm mm. I can really cook. Like my dad could cook, and he just passed that shit to me. Thank you, Dad. What aspect of your life need tremendous improvement? Maybe my working out part of my life. I need to be more consistent and I need to be, you know, more focused. Remember that people shoot straight with you or temper their words? Just be straightforward because then we can really go somewhere with that shit. If you just sitting here like sugarcoating stuff, how are we going to get to the bottom of our, you know, situation? Or whatever is going on. So just keep it a hundred. Period. Do you have a tattoo? Mm-hmm. Right here. I know it ain't straight. He ain't he fucked me up, but uh-huh. Faith. You gotta have faith. Without faith. Who was your first friend in college? Y'all yeah, never made friends in college, so <laughs> like literally I don't have no friends from college at all. What is your idea of special time together? Something relaxing, you know, probably like go take a trip to see some views. I love riding in a car and just vibing with the music all talking about shit, like different level stuff. Just stuff like What is your star sign? My who? Star sign. Your sign. Zodiac? I'm a Libra. What is the name of your first pet? My real first pet, like my first pet, like my first pet, Prince. But my family's first pet, pet Tyler. R.I.P. Tyler. Now Prince still alive and well and healthy. Y'all gonna meet him. He is a husky and y'all gonna see him. Y'all gonna love him. But yeah. Which store would you choose to max out your target? Card? Carters, Bath and Body Works. Okay, if I gotta pick out a Target, Carters, and Bath and Body Works for myself, I will pick Target. But knowing me, I will pick Carters because my baby go before myself. And what age did you go on your first date? <laughs> Papa was a rolling stone. Anyways, I went on my first date at like 15. Hey. Can't help it. I was bad. Can't help it. After a breakup, would you rather be alone or be surrounded by friends? Mm, if I'm alone, if I'm alone, I don't know what the hell. I'm I probably go to his house or some shit. But anyways, it won't never be no breakup, so I'm not going to even answer that. What is one thing you'd rather pay someone to do than yourself? 
I wouldn't pay nobody to do anything because I can do anything myself. All I got to do is go to Pinterest and type in DIY, go to YouTube and type in DIY, go to Google and type in DIY. Y'all, we can do anything we want to do, literally. We need to stop wasting our money and saving our money and doing the stuff ourselves. Like, who wouldn't want to save money? Who wouldn't want to take the time, like stressful time and just taking that time decorating creating researching like y'all we can do anything we want to do put your mind to it what is something you wish you were gifted at doing if i could i say time traveling are you a morning person or a night person both y'all i'm literally i don't know i'm like when i'm tired i'm tired but I can literally like wake up and be good all day and then don't even want to go to sleep at night i don't know why but i just feel like it's nothing to do when you sleep but it's everything to do when you up you can explore you can make money you can be happy you know whatever what is the first thing you do when you open your eyes in the morning <sighs> y'all i literally pull out my breasts and feed my baby the first thing i do every morning for almost 365 days, y'all. What is the first ass I check when you wake up in the morning? My email. <laughs> My emails. What is the last book you read? The last book I read was I Will Love You Forever to My Baby Boy. Have you forgiven yourself for past personal failures? Why or why not? Yes, I always forgive myself because that's healthy. Don't just sit there and dwell on the past. Don't be mad at yourself because if you're sitting there being mad at yourself, you're stopping yourself from reading your great, reaching your greatest potential. So with that being said, we need to stop as humans being mad at ourselves because when we're mad at ourselves, we start bringing our energy down. And then when our energy down, we put that in the universe. Then when we put that in the universe, that universe get that back to us. Knowledge. I got a lot of it to be young, I know. But yeah. What drains your energy? Negativity, people. Negative people. Negative vibes. Really, the hardest part about being a parent is the whining. And barely even that. I love everything about being a parent. What is the pettiest thing you've done to prove your point? We're going to say that for another video, y'all. Just know. Crazy. One thing you know that you wish you know as a kid. Maybe like saving my money and I save my money now. I don't know. Shit. I don't know. Next question. What are some of your bad habits? Mm, my bad habits is I get in my head, I start thinking. At the end of the day, I always remember my worth and I'm always back up there. You see what I'm saying? So even though when you low, make sure you can boost yourself back up. Because sometimes you got to be low, you got to cry. That's refreshing. That's like a new journey, a new life when you cry. Y'all yeah, like it, I love for it. your last birthday? Nothing. My cousin came over, my brother, my sister, my fiance, my son. To what extent do you trust people? Trust, y'all, that's really crazy. Like, trust is something. Like, I trust my son. That's about it. No, I'm playing. But I trust some people. To a certain extent. Like, I wouldn't trust nobody with my life, if that makes sense. But I trust somebody with, like, a certain task. Not nothing, like, life-dependent. Because I'd rather make sure I have it 100% done than, you know, somebody else putting in a 50%. What do you find yourself always procrastinating? When? What? What? Do you find yourself always procrastinating? About? Yeah. I could say YouTube. I was been supposed to start this YouTube channel, y'all, when my baby, before, even before my baby. But I ain't gonna lie, that's a lot. I'd rather be full on baby mode than, you know, try to worry about picking up a camera and all this. I ain't wanna miss out on my baby life. So I just wanted to wait till he got a little older. But now here I am, I don't have to procrastinate no more. What type of music do you dislike? Rap. I hate music. Well, I don't dislike rap, but all that rap that be like, kill this, fucking on the bit, and 
like degrading our community i hate that type of music like you would not find me jamming no type of music. now young boy that's a, that's a certain that's a different story because if you became a multi-millionaire overnight what would you buy nigga land i'm gonna buy land i'm gonna buy stock i'm gonna buy camp cattle like i'm gonna buy stuff that's gonna gain interest but i'm gonna teach y'all about that too just stay with me if you could give your younger self any advice what would it be your friends really ain't your friends they just using you for the time being they just using your good energy your good vibes because they want to be like you but once they figure out they can't be like you they gonna stop fucking with you and when they stop fucking with you you're gonna be happy period what is one bond do you want back i could say my childhood bond with my dad that's the bond i want back when was the last time you pushed yourself to your physical limits whoo the other day when i was working out y'all i've been trying to start working out slowly but surely they got me on this 25 weight i'm trying to tell them i need a 15 right now it's not like i'm weak enough little girl or nothing but damn can i build my way back up you know what i'm saying this question gonna be my last question and i'm gonna ask myself this question because he hasn't asked me this question yet why do you want to do youtube hmm good question so i want to do youtube because i really want to just be a role model to people a positive role model to young people old people middle-aged people it don't matter I want to show people how to do things that they spend millions of dollars on. I want to give people knowledge that they don't have, that they should have, that can help them and not hurt them. But yeah, it's a lot of stuff that we're going to get into that I'm going to start telling y'all about, that we're going to start talking about. Just stay tuned for girl talk, stay tuned for pranks, stay tuned for vlogs, stay tuned for everything, y'all, because I'm in the game now. I ain't letting up. Houston, Texas, I'm going to put us on the map for shit show. <laughs> but yeah, guys, thank you for tuning into my video. I hope you all liked it and enjoyed watching this video. I can't wait to make more videos. Comment down below what you want to see next, and I'll be sure to do it for you.